Hi guys, from Video Guy. Welcome to Eurotruck Simulator 2. Hi everyone, it's me. We've got five more sleeps till Christmas. It's Friday, the 20th of December. Uh, running with my NTG3, speaking at a normal level, and this is the best mic I've ever had, I think. Comparable to the Sennheiser MKH416, I believe. Let's see where we are, what we're doing, etc, etc. Company manager, garage manager. Lovely, looking at that, that's good. We've got two in there, three in there. Two there. Seven drivers, lovely. That's great. We've got 96 grand in the bank. Cool, that's lovely. Let's see where in the world I am. I think I'm somewhere in, uh, oh yeah, Bratislava. That was one I did yesterday I think okay lovely so we'll try and get a job there uh, the last two ones I've done have been um, <laughs> quite disastrous I uh, retraced my steps on one of them after falling asleep or going to sleep at the garage and came out and went the wrong way and uh, then I crashed another one and caused some damage anyway let's see about getting a job and uh, let's see what we're gonna do no, I'm doing that. Job market. That's what I meant to do. Freight market. We are in Bratislava, so we want a job from Bratislava. Uh, do do probably the next page, I reckon. Lovely. Uh, I've got someone coming in in about twenty minutes, so I don't want it too long. Oh, uh, well, that is too long. That's too long. I suppose I could interrupt it, couldn't I? One hundred ninety-two k. It's not a lot of money though, 24, let's go for that one I think, uh, that one is quite long, that one's quite long, let's just see what else there is, that is a long one, no there's not very much money for that either is there, I still look for the rate per kilometre because obviously that's uh, a better way of working really. That's not too bad. That's not too bad. 411, 403. God, there's quite a few in Bratislava. That's mega. Uh, that's looking 417 though. No way. No way. It's not very good value for money. Right, let's go and have a look at this other one, which I quite like the look of. It was, was it that one? No, that's too long. That was not too bad. That's what we're going to go for. Car parts. Righty ho. I've turned the sound down. How do we get out of here? I'll turn the sound down so it doesn't come out too loud out of my speakers, otherwise it's going to uh, be kind of an audio overload. Um, let's go this way. I think that's the way. I'm driving my uh, my lovely Scania R620. I bought that a few weeks ago. My computer was off the road for five weeks because um, of issues with overheating, etc. Uh, let's see what's going from here. This very garage, just to make sure. Uh, ba -bum, ba -bum, that's the one. No, that's not that one, is it? No, that's mega. No, no. Nope. As you were. <coughs> let's go for the other one. We're going to turn right here. Uh, what time? We've got 3.19 in the morning. So I think the whole of the UK is uh, gearing up for the weekend now then, uh, with Christmas just around the corner. Myself included. I've been ordered to take some time off work. Her. By she who must be obeyed. Hopefully this will be a fairly quick one. Play a bit later on tonight. 
and I've got a wee bit more time. Are we going? No, we're not. Not that one. <coughs> Tend to get a bit too close to the lights, and with the uh, rearview mirror setup that I've got, um, I can't actually see the colour of the light. <laughs> so I have to either look for a reflection or um, reverse back a bit, or just um, put it on a different view. Right, I think we're going here. I've got my friend the Track IR5 as a Christmas present today. They've never really appealed to me, if I'm honest with you. Um, I'm sure they're very good, but I don't want any more gizmos and gadgets. I've got enough as it is. Uh, right, take the job. Let's take that job. So, where is it? Normally around the corner here, isn't it? Which way? That way. Okay. Lovely. Different layout, isn't it? I've seen a couple of these, but um, in the earlier stages, the um, the layouts of the depot depots were fairly similar. There was only about two or three different sorts. This one, uh, quite new. Could also be the fact that I've had five weeks off the game <laughs> and I'm very rusty. That's probably the one I should go for. That excuse. Anyway, stop waffling and let's get out of here. Uh, we have got three hours and seven. We've got plenty of sleep time, so that's good. Got plenty of sleep in the bank. Let's get out of here. Turn a bit tight to get out some of these. I am still quite rusty though. I was playing it most days uh, before my computer went in for its final repairs. Um, and uh, as I say, I only got it back, well, I got it back on Sunday, which was like uh, five days ago. Um, steering wheel's upside down. But um, yeah, I've I, because of my Christmas filming schedule, I haven't been able to play on it as much as I'd like and so this is really uh, this weekend today tomorrow is the first time I'm going to really be able to get me uh, get back into the swing of things and I have forgotten a lot it's amazing you know you only um, need to a day or week or so off and uh, you get so rusty on this I do anyway <coughs> um, but I'm driving in my slippers at the moment so I normally have shoes on which is a lot more comfortable actually when you're driving a truck. I've been told I'm going to be Father Christmas on Christmas Day for the hot local hospital. That's nice of them. A bit more charity work. I was out yesterday doing photos um, for the um, severely ill children, which uh, was quite upsetting, actually. I did some nice photos for them, though, free of charge. Obviously, for charity. And um, I got roped into being Father Christmas uh, for an hour or two on Christmas Day as well. Um, which I'll do if I'm if I'm needed. Um, I think I will be. Um, haven't a clue what I've got to do. I suppose just have children sit on me lap if you're allowed to do that. I don't know, <laughs> and hand out gifts. Something different though. <coughs> and it's only for an hour or two, so it shouldn't be so bad. Right, where are we actually going? Banska Bystrica. Never heard of it. It sounds a bit sort of Polish or something like that. Banska Bystrica. Car parts. Fair enough. This is the latest version of um, ETS2. It's 182 or something like that. Not sure what the improvements or adjustments are on this. Maybe a couple of minor bug fixes. I don't think they've got rid of the very annoying AI vehicle stopping for no reason in front of you and then speeding up. Um, it's caught me out a couple of times, but um, um, I'll just keep up with it and just do the updates and whatever. But I'm um, still enjoying the game. I'm not going to um, install any mods uh, because I just, I'm just i happy with the way the game is. I'm not very adventurous on that side. And also because of the immense amount of problems I had with this bloody PC when I got it, um, it was 
crashing and blue screening and this that and the other I don't want to introduce any potential hazards to it so I'm, I'm happy for now at least just to keep it sort of um, you know on a fairly basic um, setup here I'm happy with it for now I just want the PC to run correctly and then once I've built up my confidence in it again I can maybe consider getting some mods but I'm as I say very happy with things as they are within ETS 2 at the moment so um, there we go. When uh, I've got to stop saying it, I'm, I'm my biggest critic, and when I listen to some of my videos, uh, I do say "there we go" a lot, and I also got a sort of fairly monotone voice. I do try and like that. I do try and change the notes uh, to make it sort of vaguely interesting. But you've got to have a, a fairly interesting voice, and you've got to have a, an interesting topic topic to talk about. Um, and I tend to sort of go into waffle mode because silence, it's like the radio, silence on here is is very, um, it's not its not right, you shouldn't have silence. Um, you can have a few seconds here and there, but um, I think the idea is to make it mildly entertaining and uh, to sort of waffle on about something and try and make that waffle interesting. Um, some people can do it, lots can't, and I think I'm probably one of the can't brigade, but... I do quite enjoy it. It does um, it does take my attention a lot away from driving sometimes, so I'm sort of waffling on and not seeing uh, what the speed limit is or uh, having external view of the truck like this and then suddenly realising, as I did on a couple of videos ago, I was going into uh, the back of a, um, a log carrying uh, truck at about 60 miles an hour that was doing this AI thing it was just slowing down for no reason and then uh, <coughs> excuse me uh, starting up again and of course just as I come back into the cab view I saw it had stopped in front of me and I went bam right into the back of it <laughs> it was quite funny really and um, well you had to be there uh, and that's on YouTube um, I can't remember where I was going but it cost me 13,000 pounds damage it was a hell of a I think I had like 40 percent damage or something I can't remember now but um it was uh, it was a it was a good earner. Well, it should have been a good earner, uh, but it cost me thirteen thousand pound in repairs. Um, yes, I do remember those things. But I, I say I, I do tend to sort of waffle on, and um, because it's a, a simulator, it's a game. I'm not really paying as much attention to if it was real life, um, and uh, you know it, it can catch me out sometimes. But um, I try and make them as interesting as I can. I'm sure they're not the most interesting video on YouTube. There's plenty of others. But the, the, the knack of it is, as I say, to get the levels right, uh, to get the quality right, the quality of the, the audio. It's very important to me, as you probably know now, if you've watched any of my videos. Um, and to um, just say some interesting stuff in an interesting sort of voice, rather than monotone and talk like that all the time. There's there's also a lot of um, videos out on YouTube that actually, uh, for example, have ETS too, but there's no dialogue, there's no talking. And I think that's essential to have talking because it kind of it blends it all together. You know, anyone can just make a video like this, um, but I, I don't think that's interesting. That's that's my opinion anyway. Um, no matter how, how dull your voice is, I think it, it, it brightens up a video uh, to, to add some commentary. Um, and you know, it just it just makes it a bit more interesting. Just my opinion, but that's what I think, and that's why I do it. And also, I enjoy it. I'm into audio and video for a living as well, so I should be able to do it pretty well. Uh, the setup, the technical setup, anyway. That's 80. Here's my visual uh, indicator. Car brakes going on, so he's obviously slowing down for a speed camera. I'm doing 84. I notice on this that gear changes that would really slow down a lot quicker than that in the real life um, so you need to use a bit of a, a brakes as well I can put it on cruise control at 71 kmh 73 it is now All right then. oh it's gone down to 70 the speed limit um, yeah this, the, the fines here as well are bloody humongous uh, and on a fairly low um, income on a job, if you're on like two or three grand, and you 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 get careless, uh, it can cost you like four hundred odd pounds or euros per per penalty, 
And if you've got two or three, that's going to almost wipe out any profit you can expect. Um, it's it's horrendous. So you do really have to, um, you know, concentrate and try not to get fined. Anyway, uh, 5.20, dawn, one of my favourite times of day. In fact, probably the favourite time of day for me in real life. Uh, especially when it's light. I hate the winter. I really abhor the winter. Uh, I don't like dark. I don't like cold. And I love summer and spring. And uh, this... Um, uh, I don't know whether it sticks in the same season on ETS2, but it always seems to be quite summery or spring-like. Um, I think you can get some mods that are wintry. You can get some snow and frost and things like that. But I actually enjoy this 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 sight, this visual. Uh, you know, five, six, seven o'clock in the morning. I think it's lovely. All right, where are we going? Going straight on here. So I shall get out of this lane and go over here. We have got uh, 33k to do. I should be able to finish this just before my client gets in here at 6 o'clock. It's 10 to 6 here, p.m. in the UK. Um, this setup is in my office and it does bring a smile to some clients' faces when uh, I tell them how hard I work, and I do work work sort of 12 14 hour days but they uh, they look at the uh, the game gaming chair i've got here which is a, a play seat i think it's called play seat evolution and i've got my logitech g27 and i've got my voiceover mic and uh, everything and they sort of smile and say oh yeah been working hard again have we <laughs> uh, but it's it's great to do this right we're going off here then to the right The noise you might... Oh, okay, then we're not going. No, a bit too early. The noise you can hear, the clicking, is, is probably my gear changing. It's it's not the quietest of gear changes. It is the Logitech, as I've said. Um, and I've heard quieter gear changes, but this is just right for me. I've had it about oh, four months, I'd say, three or four months now. I think there was a speed camera there, wasn't it? Um, and it's it's worked very well. Good timing. Make sure no one pulls out in front of me. Make sure I um, keep to the speed limit as far as I can. I noticed a huge change as I should expect when I went up from my 360 was it 340 my Scania uh, to the 620 I've got now it's just a beast it really is not too bad on the fuel either it doesn't drink it which uh, has got to be a consideration when you're running a, uh, a business like this a sim anyway Okay, let's have a little looky outside. Horn happy, that's what I should be called, horn happy. Let me go in left here. Okie dokie, I think we're all going left. The big trucks are anyway, because I'm not allowed in those areas, I don't know why. We're up on the right then. I can see my space already. I normally prefer to come in here and then hang a left and then reverse that way. Just a, my preference. So just to be different, we're going to go this way just to see what I can do. My imp my my reversing has improved. It's not brilliant. But it has improved, and uh, this may surprise people, but this is the only way I like to do it, which is an aerial view. Backwards, everything's in reverse. Let's see how we get on. That's a bit sharp. Let's straighten them up. Not good. 
Right, we're gonna come out severely. That's why I like coming into the turning left because generally on, on yards like this there is a lot more room to manoeuvre. But uh, I do like a challenge sometimes. be the fastest reverser but generally I get a result that's not the best I've done but I think we'll be given that oh that's very messy with the cab but that's where I'm going to leave it because all I want is the reddies give me the reddies what was that worth a couple of grand wasn't it five grand lovely I'm still on level 22 I want to get up to level 23 before the end of the day Let's see where we are. So we've got 4% on there. What I'm going to do is have a quick drive round. Uh, diagnostics. Uh, there's nothing serious. It's just wheels and tyres. Yeah, okay. I'll drive round, find, um, find a garage before my customer gets here. And uh, we'll take it from there. Where's the garage? It's over there, isn't it? I'm going to go out here and do a right. Um, not left there, down the end and turn left. Oh, I thought that pedestrian was going to cross the road there. I've never seen him do that. then aren't we somewhere oh let's stop at the red light there John it's a bit like that where I live in Essex and it's traffic lights every three yards practically we're just going up here on the right I believe that'll do I'm a bit fussy with uh, repairs and things. I like to get it done as uh, soon as possible. Okay. Service. Let's repair it. We have a quick look and see if we can get um, any sensible um, upgrades. I don't want silly paint jobs and things that you spend 25 grand on. Um, I don't, you know, if it, if it makes the truck work better, then it's fine. If it makes it look different, it's not actually earning any money. And uh, I'd rather just get, you know, get sort of um, practical things. I don't know what we can put on there, really. Mirrors, that's not going to make it work better. Sun visor, that's not going to make it work better. Uh, nope. 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 Six and a half grand. Nah. Sixteen grand for new wheels. Nah. What can we have inside? What's this? Drivers, but I've got that already. Nope. Nothing. Okay. I'm going to leave it there and I'm going to wait for my customer and that's it I shall see you on the next one uh, so thanks very much for watching and tatty bye from the video guy ta -ra.